Hello everyone! Today we will discuss how to get to Rome City from Sibitibekia Port. Our ship was docked in Sibitibekia Port at about 8 a.m. in the morning and our all aboard time was 3.30 p.m. My wife and I planned to visit Rome and we decided to do it on our own. Before I get started, please subscribe to our channel if you like more videos and travel tips like this one. Civitavecchia is about 87 kilometers or 54 miles away from Rome. And you have two options to choose from. The first one is to get a taxi from the port and you will get to Rome in about one and a half hours depending on the traffic. The price of a taxi is ranging from 40 to 60 euros. The second option is to ride a train, which is what we did. From the ship, you can walk to the train station or ride a shuttle for a fee. It's about 3 euros and it will bring you directly to the train station. At the train station, you can buy your tickets to Rome Termini. The fee is only 5 euros one way and 10 euros round trip. You don't prefer buses and metro in Rome? No, no. No. Just train. Just train. How much round trip? Okay, we already here in the train station in uh, track 3. So that's what uh, the track going to Rome. We purchased the ticket to the Civitivecchia port station and the price of the ticket is 460 euros. 4.6 per person. But Rhea and I purchased a round trip so we don't have to worry about going back. All we have to do is um, just present the ticket, scan it later on. So in case there's a lot of people later, uh, we don't have to worry about it. Yeah, so round trip it's 9 euros 20 cents. Yes, and we're waiting for the train at 8.40 a.m. And good thing also on this station, they have elevator. So even though you have luggages, you can, there's actually a lift. Unlike other stations here in Rome, some doesn't have elevator, so you have to carry your own luggage. When you get to Rome, there are several stations that you can get off depending where you like to go. For us, we went to Vatican, so we got off at Roma S. Pietro, or St. Peter Station. The main station of Rome is the Roma Termini, which is the closest to the Colosseum, Roman Forum, and Pantheon. You can also get off to Roma Ostiense, which is close to Bats of Caracalla, Circus Maximus, and Palatine Hill. The duration of our trip from Civitebecchia to St. Peter Station it's about an hour and we walk 15 minutes going to Vatican City. Our plan was to visit the Vatican City and catch the Mass at 10.30 in the morning in St. Peter's Basilica. Okay, so the Mass is just finished and it's a good feeling. I think actually this is one of my bucket list yeah. to attend the Mass in St. Peter's Basilica here in Vatican City. So, we're going so to the There's a lot of people and we got here maybe 45 minutes, or no, actually 30 minutes before the Mass. But there are still some chairs and um, we were still able to sit. And... Actually, there's not a lot of people. There's not much people to the last, compared before. The last time we visited. Yeah. So. After the Mass, we were so lucky because the Pope did the Angelus on that day. About 1 p.m., we head back to Civitavecchia. If you like to know how to get to Civitavecchia Fort from Rome City, please watch our other video and check out the link in the description. Thank you for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and like this video. And if you have any questions, please leave a comment below. Until next time, vacation seekers, this is RG from Food, Travel, and Inspiration.